Sandler. Bird. I don't really have Bird. 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 It's Adam Sandler. Bird, dude. A f- um, it's just so we, even my everything's just mm-hmm. it's just weird. Like you still do you dye your mustache? No. So that's crazy it how comes in dark. dark that is yeah. compared yeah. to like then you you having some gray. But, I don't but, really but, have but, gray. But, but as it keeps Not going, yeah, yeah, yeah. but but if I trim it so it starts off and then it gets gray. Yeah. So if it, if it gets longer, it gets like yeah, it was. Yeah, gr- yeah, it's yeah, gray, yeah. gray. It actually doesn't make any sense. No. It- a few moments later. Hey, can, I, can, can I? Can I? be honest? Yeah. Sure. I, I used just for men last night on my. <laughs> on <laughs> what? On my mustache. <laughs> <laughs> Piece of shit. I knew it. Ha! Why did you do it? Tell us. You, you, you. It was so great, but I'm glad I got that off my chest. I get, I get how you got confused. It's all good. Nick, but you're, you're you, awfully quiet. Did you go to college? I did. I went to University of Minnesota. I didn't finish though. I dropped out to play poker because I'm an idiot. But I got a 31 on my ACT. Poker. You did played you really? Poker? Yeah. I, I don't know if I'd brag like in a I'm 31 not bra- on ACT. <laughs> no, that's really good. 31 no, that's, is good. 31's really good. Any 30 or higher is really good. Yeah, Brendan really doesn't know what's good. Uh, 36. Well, I, got, I got a 32. No, you did. I swear on my life I had a 32. On an ACT. I, on ACT. I'm, yeah. I'm impressed, but I consider that really good. Yeah. Yeah, I consider both of them good, mm-hmm. bro. You can't say 31. You can't say 31 is bad and 32 is good. I think he was being <laughs> humble. He was saying he, I, he I'm did not do saying that. Good. I, like, yeah. 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 <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there's there's some um, big scores out. There. Thirty four will get you into like any place in the, yeah, in the really? country. Oh wow. Yeah. Thirty six is high as you can get, right? Yeah, yeah. I'm walking out, drain the old snaky snake, drain the old hogaroo. I look over, I'm like, God damn, that looks like Adam Sandler. My childhood hero. I'm like, motherfucker, that's Adam Sandler. Oh. I'm like, I'm not gonna say anything. And then he looks over at me. I'm waiting for my girl. To, she's in the bathroom. I'm waiting for her. He walks over. He goes, what's up, bro? I'm like, no way. What's up, man? Then we walk out of the bathroom, and he's there, and he goes, hey. And I, I, he could tell I was looking at him, and I'm, like, telling my kids about him. And he goes, hey. And I walk over. He goes, what's up, Mr. Sandler? He goes, so I was waiting, and he <laughs> came up to me. I was at the comedy store two nights before, and I think he was around then. He came up to me. He was like, you're that funny guy that kicks ass. You're the uh, tough guy that does comedy, right? You're the ass kicker that tells jokes, right? You're the ass kicker oh, that tells yeah, jokes. Yeah, and I was like, he knows who you are. I was like, barely. His so just kids were there. He knew you. He, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah I did uh, probably four months ago, three fifteen, twelve times. Twelve? So, yeah, three fifteen, twelve times. Yeah. TRT was, did it twelve times. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you did it twelve times. I, yeah, I did two twenty five forty. I heard it was no a shit. Yeah. I heard Yo, it was a small percentage. Yeah. Maybe two. You think he's lying? Big power. Come on. Oh, nice. Big power. Oh. Oh. Come on. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Hard body, baby. Let's go. Well, two summers ago, I did 225 42 times. Le- yeah. Legs? No. You, you, Benching. It, reps? Yeah. That's crazy. Crazy. What did you do? Like, what? Just like this. Boom. The whole you, straight forty-two, straight, or you stop yeah, straight forty-two, just like the NFL Combine. They that do two twenty-five as many crazy. times as you can. Oh God. But you also know? Lizzo. She she, yeah. she does too much. Did you think so? I've seen her ass way too many times. Really? We haven't seen it more than I feel like any Anyone other. Anyone else? Well, girl. you didn't go to the like Lakers Miley, game. Miley Cyrus. <laughs> were you at that Lakers I game? I was at that Lakers Wait, game. Wait, you were there? Yes. It shut the thing down. I know. I loved it, though. I was happy for her. I she love it. I love that she's it. making everybody uncomfortable. Step on for these four necks, quarters? Lizzo. Step for on every For four neck. quarters, though? Too much. She, she twerked every quarter? Every quarter. <laughs> every quarter. Wow, every that's quarter. a lot of work. Oh, let's go to the Lizzo. Oh, one. please go to the... Okay, so I'm sure you guys have heard about this. I haven't seen the outfit because everyone blurs it out. The outfit Thank essentially God. looks like a really long black oh, t-shirt, disgusting. and then the back <laughs> is just a circle where her ass is hanging this out. This is a hit play for me. Wait, what? What is this? When did this happen? Right. My kids don't want to look at your fucking ass at, at a the basketball game. game. I That's took ridiculous. my kid to a basketball game. Yeah. But also, it's not Press about you, fat bitch. It's yeah. ain't about you. <laughs> Enjoy the game. My, yeah. He, what was the pet situation growing up? Was there one? Any lizards, N- snakes, birds? Name it, keep going. And then I had every animal. You know, geckos, fucking tarantulas, rep, every, uh, I had a bird that somebody gave my mom. and I was like, can we keep it? She said, I guess. 
Bro. She stole that for sure, right? We're all... You're right. She just stole a bird. She stole that bird from the zoo because it wasn't like a peacock, or like a pear. It was a f- this a fucking bird, dude. It was a f- a huge bird. Like this guy's a- got a toucan in his room. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. I think it was a peacock. <laughs> but we didn't have. My mom was like, "We're not gonna cage for it. Put it in your closet." I'm like, "That makes sense." At eight. So I had in my closet, but this bird had anger issues, so he'd come in and just attack him. Yeah, he's in a closet, dude. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. So then one day I was sick of getting attacked. I just left the closet, opened the front door open. He was just like, later, losers. And then. Holy shit. That's yeah. Wild. So I loved animals. Do you, but have any, I, do you have normal dogs, cats, anything? Had a. Fish? Had, so, yeah, man. So I had cats when I was a kid. Dude, <laughs> I grew up with a uh, pit bull named Spud. <laughs> he was white and black. You guys have any pets? And my mom goes, "Yeah, we have, we have three cats." And and then he was like, "Oh, I had a hamster. This cute. He's my favorite hamster named Eddie." <clears throat> Back to that story. The only person I've ever been in the same room with. I'm like, I gotta get a pick. I have to. And I was like, How am I gonna do it? And then he came up to me. I was like, Man, you think this guy really has a chance? I was like, I holy shit, it was Drake. Oh, I, I, was, no I, was, shit. I was working for Showtime, and I'm like, Man, this is crazy. I see Drake. I'm like, Holy fuck, that's Drizzy Drake running through the six. And I was like, I got, I, 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 I got to get a picture. I have yeah. to. It's fucking, he's my favorite. And I was all nervous. And then I hear out of the corner of my ear, man, you think Connor really has a chance, man? I heard you talking all that bullshit. And I was like, yeah, actually, like, holy shit, what up, dog? I need a picture. He's like, yeah, no doubt. I was like, oh, fuck. Yeah. Only time I've well, ever done. But you, you were also there where Will Smith and Robert Downey Jr. came running up. I didn't you. ask them for a picture. Yeah, though. but they were like, oh, it's the hybrid. And they wanted to talk to you. And, yeah, of- Robert Downey was like throwing front kicks at me. Like, very cool, man. <laughs> They just keep going. They just went down to his fucking mind. And then you, I don't know if he's still doing, he's doing podcasts. And, and I was at the mall in Westfield and he, uh, he came up to me. He was like, glad to have you on the podcast, man. I was like, oh, cool. What do you, what do you, what do you guys talk about? He's like, chicks. It's a relationship show. <laughs> I'm like, no, absolutely not. Dude. That's so funny. Really? Yeah. 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 Uh, nothing uh, triggers me more than guys in cars. I hate ages. rep. <laughs> Talk to me. I tell anything. myself when we go to the car show, I go that that's for guys who uh, don't have you know who you are don't, really insecure. Yeah. When when you're in an idle and I'm like, what are you doing, dude? Like, sounds like a NASCAR. It sounds pretty badass. Listen to that air whistle. For I know it. it's turbo. <laughs> also, you didn't Bikes build now. the car. Why are you flat? I, when we go to the car true. show and guys are like, you like my Ferrari? It's like, you didn't build it. Why are you acting That's like this? That's pretty funny, actually. You yeah, have nothing right. to do with it. My happiness comes from the build, the chase of the build. That's what I love to do. Yeah. You just mm-hmm. bought it. Yeah. Why are you acting like this? Good thing I souped up this Lightning to over 600 horsepower. This Ford Lightning that I've hooked up. They want to show you. It's like cup. security at the club. They're all arrogant. Mm-hmm. It's like, you don't know in the club, dude. You're right. minimal. Oh, um, did I send you the video of it shooting fire on the highway chin? No, I didn't get it. I can send it. <laughs> wow. Just for the fans, just so they know. Okay. How many pull-ups can you do? I don't know, man. You don't do pull-ups? Oh, I do pull-ups. I've never like met in, in college is my thing. How many did you do in college? College, I had the well, so at CU, I, I did have the record for a while for tight ends, fullbacks. And then when I uh, went to the pros. I trained with the, he's my, one of my best friends, but he was the head strength and conditioning coach for the Broncos. So I was like, what's the record? And I set the record. And then I had the record for, I don't know, six months. And then uh, I came in one day and they're like, oh, dude, somebody broke your pull-up record. I'm like, yeah, it was like, I, I, I would tell anybody about my fucking pull-up record. Like, somebody broke it. I'm like, who the fuck, who? Like that new kid the fucking Broncos drafted, dude. I'm like, what kid? They're all Tim Tebow. Oh. Came in there, saw your record, destroyed it. And I was like, oh, hell no. Hell, yeah. He, he was like, yeah, uh, if you're down to work out with him, he's here tomorrow. So I came tomorrow, and then we just, you know, did our thing. And then me and him got super close. Yeah. Uh, my mom, we didn't grow up rich. My mom, I uh, made her take me to Payless shoe stores. And I, I, I wore a, uh, the McGregor's at the time, cleats. Sure. They were the oh, mold the cleats. Dude, yeah. I wore them. At recess? Two- no, hold up. I wore them to school. So I'm walking through. Everyone's making fun of me. It's going clink, clink, clink. But then the other dope thing my mom loved is because they're mold cleats, I'd wear them on black, you know, black top and all mm-hmm. over, is they wore out over time, so I didn't need new shoes. Ah, so she was like, go. oh, yeah, you just keep wearing those, and they turn into regular shoes. Like, Wait, so you wore run-down spikes or cleats as for two shoes? years? Yeah, yeah. McGregor's, yeah, yeah. Man. And Will Smith asked me to, uh, <laughs> Will Smith asked me if I did private training. 
He did. Who? Mm-hmm. Will Smith was like, "Hey man, you're the reason why you punched Buddy in the face." Yo, the reason he slapped old boy. Oh, I didn't train. You're the reason why Chris Rock. No, I didn't train with him. You I didn't did didn't take him up on it. I got different vibes. What'd you say to him? No. Want me to hold mitts for you? You, you didn't say no. To I promised you. I was like, I well, at the time, as a current UFC fighter, I'm like, oh, I don't, I don't like hold mitts, dog. If you want to put me in fucking will I whatever the fucking I am legend three, I'm yeah. in. But I don't hold mitts, daddy. You get there. I just got a mitts, daddy. Sin- but I don't hold mitts, daddy. You get there. I just got a mitts, got a sin- yeah, because mine didn't get flagged. I say some dicey stuff. I didn't monetize mine. You say stuff in there, like but weird stuff? I, I don't know. Uh, I guess the well, vaccine the re- stuff. Yeah, yeah, and one of the reasons I didn't go with Comedy Central is because I said so, um, I was yeah, making yeah, fun yeah. of news yeah. and COVID, and they're like, no. I understand. So I'll upload it to YouTube and not monetize it. That. So you didn't monetize it. And then, it, so you had it for 15 years and died. Yeah, died, passed away. And But it was a good dog. Great dog. Uh-huh. I mean, couldn't take it around other dogs. I've never heard, heard of the dog out. before. Yeah. Dog's name was Jersey. <laughs> yeah. Obviously, the dog could not have, and no offense, Jersey, but the dog could well, not she, have had a huge experience in your life, I don't think, if you've never mentioned it. <laughs> I mean, you guys have never asked me. See, that's your problem. Yeah. You've never asked you me. You ask a lot of questions yeah. like, was it in a barn? Yeah. But not the right ones. Yeah, not the right ones. You don't, <laughs> yeah. don't want to know me, dude. Huh? You know? Mm. I don't want, I th- figure you would say at some point, hey, back when I had Jersey. No one asked me ever. This happened. No, I, I had a pit bull for about whatever. fucking 15 years. Unreal. Yeah, dude. Either. Yeah. <laughs> I, I grew up dog. with a pit bull. Nick didn't know, Chino, I grew, did I grew up. I didn't know. <laughs> Unbelievable. <laughs> no one's ever asked me, dude. Did you Oh, yeah. <laughs> Jay, you you, own... Jay used to watch it. We'd go at a restaurant and she like, she didn't have a lot of money, so she'd get paid and we'd go to Chili's. I grew up, Chili's was like our fucking Del Frisco. And then the check comes on. I was like, okay, cool. So um, I'll meet you up front, right? I'll pull the car around. And then uh, you guys just, when you're done, you meet me out there. She just did Dine and Dash for the longest time, dude. Holy really? shit. Dash, yeah. Anybody ever catch you? Never. never. Really? I, this is even a flex. <laughs> when, I, when I was fighting, I think when I was fighting, Mitrione mm. went to the doctor because you have to do all the- He says, you're dead. <laughs> yeah, he was like, you're basically dead. No. Um, my resting heart rate was 30, 37. 37 or 38. I'm just guessing. No, no, it was, that like, is it was like 38 or 30. It was right below wow. 40. And the guy's like, and he worked with Lance Armstrong. He's like, the only, you're, you're tied for Lance Armstrong for the best resting heart rate. Come on. That is so crazy. That's so your heart was working so good. Yeah. And I was an on EPO. So I take the crown. Okay, so he beat me there. Okay, so look, you're, among... you're a dick, Nick. That's what the doctor yeah, yeah. said, bro. Yeah, he's at 32, which that's crazy. So fake every news. two, Basically in the neighborhood I grew up in in Aurora, Colorado, was predominantly black. So the way to be, like, to fit in was to be good at sport. I grew up in Aurora, Colorado, which was predominantly like a black neighborhood. So to fit in, sports was the thing. Born and raised in Aurora, Colorado, mm-hmm. uh, mainly predominantly black neighborhood, uh, black. Uh, divorced parents. Okay. Black neighborhood. So that's where comedy and uh, sports kicked in. It's not that I'm violent or I like beating people up. I just had no other option. Well, from speaking to you, you said kind of quite the contrary, that you were not violent and in the fighting very much. Were you in a lot of street fights in your life? No, no, no. Zero. Zero I, I got in fight. one ever in college, and then uh, that's about it. What I'm saying is you've also been in- You're talking about street fights, right, hey, I'm talking about I've street, been street fights. Fight. I've been more street fights than you. I don't think you've been about. in more than I've been. I don't. You've been more you fights been, than me. I've been in as many fights as you've been in. Oh, my in, God. In, in, in the street? I know you, reality. dude. You don't fight. First of all, I what promise the fuck you I've been in more mean? fights with, than you, Brian. What? How many fights have you been in? I couldn't even count. You? I know your personality. You weren't fight, street fighting all the time. I was street fighting. I was street fighting with my brother, the neighborhood we grew up sure, in. Sure, you're It was your, a your way brother. of, the, it's the way we grew up, B. 